Good morning grade threes. Today I'm going to show you the breakdown method with, um, using hundreds. Um, so when there's no tens or units to borrow from. So let's say we have the number 4,800 minus 3,124. So we break it up like we usually do. We have 4,000 minus 3,000. 800 minus 100, 0 minus 20, and 0 minus 4. Now remember, an important part of this is to make sure that you have spaces for your hundreds, tens, units, and thousands. So let's start. Units, tens, hundreds, and thousands. So, where do we always start? At the units. Can I say zero take away four? No, because I have nothing. So, I can't take four away. I can't borrow from the tens because there are no tens. So, I'm going to go and I'm going to go by hundred. Go borrow from the hundred. There will be 700 left, but I can't put a hundred here. I put the hundred here. Now, I have a hundred minus twenty, but I still need a ten over here. So I borrow again, but I only borrow a 10 because I only need a 10. There will be 90 left, and this becomes 10. Now it's easy. 10 minus 4 is 6. 90 minus 20 is 70. Remember to write it in the correct spot. 700 minus 100 is 600. Can you see that the 6 is under the 100s? And 4,000 minus 3,000 is is 1,000. Okay, and then remember we took the numbers apart, now we have to put them back together. 6, 7, 6, 1. And there we go.